actual material cost. Now, in manufacturing, this can be the raw materials, purchased components. As I mentioned, in, in some companies, it can be supplies that are used, like healthcare. And these are truly variable costs. You, you produce one more item, you will consume more material. You produce fewer items, you're going to consume less material. Likewise, if you see more patients, you're going to consume more, more supplies. So the actual cost of your material, it's a function of price and usage or quantity. Okay, it's, it's, it's a simple equation. Price times quantity is to equals total cost. So what drives price? From a lean viewpoint, it's the value that your supplier provides to you, which means it's, a, it's really a function of delivery, supplier delivery, supplier quality, supplier lead time. That value is worth something to you, and that's the price you're paying. And usage is about how much you're using to sell products, provide services, how much inventory do you have, how much scrap you have. You know, from an operational focus, you focus on improving material flow. That then will reduce inventory and reduce the usage or the quantity. You focus on reducing scrap. That's going to reduce the quantity. You focus on overall supplier performance to get the best service from your suppliers at a fair price. This is a lot different than you know, some companies that they basically just find, try to find the lowest supplier possible or the lowest price supplier possible, or they commit the anti-lean behavior of asking for uh, bulk purchase discounts to lower the price and then have a lot of inventory. So the financial focus, and again, you want to understand actual material cost and what's driving it. So focus on measuring improvement in contribution margin and days of inventory. 